High Mobility Artillery Rocket System, or HIMARS, is a light multiple rocket launcher system developed by Lockheed Martin. It is a relatively new system, having entered service with the U.S. military in 2005. It is a full-spectrum, all-weather, 24-7, lethal and wheeled precision strike weapon system. HIMARS is a C-130 air transportable wheeled launcher mounted on 5-ton family of medium tactical vehicles XM-1140 A1 truck chassis organic to field artillery brigades. It is designed to be highly mobile and capable of firing a variety of rockets and missiles, including the MGM-140 Army Tactical Missile System. HIMARS can be mounted on a variety of vehicles, including the family of medium tactical vehicles and the M1140 and M1142 Striker Mobile Gun System. With a range of up to 300 kilometers, HIMARS is suitable for long-range strikes and is used by the U.S. military and several other countries for a variety of missions, including artillery support, air defense, and precision strike and has already proven to be a valuable asset in a number of conflicts, including in Iraq and Afghanistan. One of the key features of Amars is its automated fire control system, which allows it to accurately engage targets without the need for manual calculations. This system is based on advanced computer algorithms that can calculate the trajectory of a rocket or missile and adjust its course as needed to ensure a precise impact on the target. The fire control system also includes a variety of sensors, such as radar and thermal cameras, that allow HIMARS to detect and track targets at long distances. HIMARS is operated by a crew of three, consisting of a commander, driver, and gunner. The system is designed to be easy to operate and maintain, with a simple and reliable system that requires minimal training and support. This makes a Mars an attractive option for militaries around the world, as it can be deployed quickly and easily to support a wide range of missions. In addition to its mobility and accuracy, the Mars is also highly versatile, as it can be equipped with a variety of different rockets and missiles depending on the mission requirements. For example, the Adams missile is capable of delivering a variety of payloads, including submunitions, to targets up to 300 kilometers away. This allows Amars to engage a wide range of targets, from enemy troops and equipment to air defense systems and command and control centers. One of the main advantages of Amars is its ability to deliver precise and effective firepower with minimal collateral damage. The system's rockets and missiles are equipped with a variety of guidance systems, including GPS, which allow them to hit their targets with high accuracy. This makes a Mars an ideal choice for missions where minimizing civilian casualties is a top priority. In addition to its military applications, the Mars has also been used for a variety of other purposes, including disaster relief and border security. Its mobility and versatility make it well-suited for a variety of different roles. Here is also some of its specifications. Empty weight is 29,800 pounds. Combat loaded weight, 35,800 pounds. Max speed, 94 kilometers per hour with max cruising range of 483 kilometers. HIMARS is considered to be one of the most transportable rocket systems due to its ability to be transported by truck, making it relatively easy to move to different locations on the battlefield. It is designed for rapid deployment, with a road speed of up to 65 miles per hour, and has a small logistical footprint, which makes it more mobile than traditional rocket systems. However, there are other systems that could be considered portable, like the M270 MLRS, which is also highly transportable and has a similar flexibility in deployment. Overall, the Mars is a powerful and effective weapon system that is used by militaries around the world to support a wide range of missions. With its high mobility, accuracy, and versatility, the Mars is capable of delivering effective firepower in a variety of different scenarios, making it an invaluable asset for any military.